very lucky to live here. You have all this beauty right on your doorstep. But I want to show you what else you have. But you've got to do something about. Okay, Starsky and Hutch has done, done our beach clean up today and done our share of cleaning up. Now, this roof here, along this walkway, has all got rubbish on it. It's all got to be removed. Because you're right next to the river, this beautiful river, and you're in there. You know, when you go along here, you will see there's more rubbish. And it's got to be cleaned up, it can't be just left, because when the wind comes, just blow it straight down into the river. There's plastic bags there, there, rubbish down here. Look at it all. That's got to be cleaned up. You can't just leave it all there, right next to that beautiful, clear river you have. You're lucky to have it, look at it. Yeah. A lot of it is plastic. We'll get easily blown into the wind, into the river. Just down in the bushes there. It's all down here. This is why we have nine billion tons of rubbish, and God knows how much of it's actually in our oceans. Look, oh. it's all mounting up. You might just think it's a little bit here, but it all counts. It's all along here. Blue bottle down there. You can see how crystal clear that water is. Fantastic, you know? And it's also, you can see all this rubbish down there. But you just look at it all. Yeah. Now what maybe the council have to do is on the fence is put posts coming out with netting on so it can't be thrown down. Because who's going to go down there and pick all this up now? In reality, nobody. So it's going to end up in the river. Let's look at it all. Beaches might be clean, but this ain't. And then no one comes and sits and sunbathes on here, do they? How clear that water is. See who's going to now pick that up? Yeah, you know, next thing will be in the river, and then what? In the stomach of a whale, whatever. This is a mirador again, and again you'll find there's all rubbish there, bottles, polystyrene. You know, it's not just the beaches you need to look after; it's everywhere. Look down there. Now I say, me and staff, you've done a beach clean up today, so. The local people can come and do something. You live here and you have this on your doorstep. So you need to look after it. Well, I live in Manchester, you know, there's no river for me to enjoy. And you have this right on your doorstep. But you also have all this rubbish down here. Cups, bags, polystyrene. The steps going down, so no reason why you can't come down and pick it up. No excuses. It's all down there. No excuses whatsoever for not doing it. And please don't tell me you've got no time. That's a lot of nonsense. Everyone's got 24 hours a day. You can sit, watch TV, and everything else. Sit in a bar, drinking coffee. You can spend five minutes just picking up some of your rubbish. Well, not necessarily your rubbish, but somebody else's rubbish. Down there, you can see. Plastic bags in there. There's more down there. Yeah. So people actually can get along here if they walk along. They can come down here. There's bottles there. There's more carrier bags there. A whole load of stuff down here. And look at that. Now, this is unbelievable. Look, all this here, all this here. And I say dogs are not allowed on the beach. You just look at the state of this. Mm. 
Okay. Again, there's fishing nets and everything else I can see in the rocks here. See, you can see there's all fishing nets in there, green nets and stuff. There's a whole lot of netting just down there. I just wonder where that's coming from. More plastic bottles. All down there. It's all in here, the rocks, everything else. You can't get away from it. There's plastic bags in there. All this. See, you think it's clean, but it's not. It's just, it's just everywhere. There's all plastic rubbish down there. You just imagine there's one little spot on the earth how much plastic rubbish there actually is. Look at all this stuff here. Now we occupy this planet as us, we actually own it. We don't own nothing. And whatever we do own can be taken away from us. If we're not careful, we're going to lose it. It's one of the most incredible planets. We can actually live on and survive. I don't respect it.